हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल जस्ट मी लॉग इन योर क्रेडेंशियल्स एंड वन स्टूडेंट विद दैट जस्ट मी कम बैक ओवर हियर स्क्रॉल डाउन नाउ हियर यू कैन सी डोमेन जस्ट मी क्लिक ऑन दिस वेरीफाई डोमेन ओवर हियर नाउ जस्ट मी वेट क्लिक ऑन दिस नेक्स्ट ओवर हियर एंड देन क्लिक ऑन दिस वेरीफाई लाइक दिस वे नाउ व्हाट यू डू जस्ट मी कम बैक ओवर हियर एंड क्लिक ऑन द टास्क नंबर 2 जस्ट मी स्क्रॉल डाउन एंड फ्रॉम हियर जस्ट मी कॉपी दिस अकाउंट रिकवरी जस्ट मी कॉपी लाइक दिस कम बैक ओवर हियर वेट फॉर अ सेकंड नाउ हियर जस्ट मी सर्च फॉर दैट लाइक दिस वे हिट एंटर नाउ हियर यू कैन सी सिक्योरिटी अकाउंट रिकवरी जस्ट मी क्लिक ओवर हियर जस्ट मी वेट Now here you can see user account recovery. Just me click on this pencil icon and from here just me click on the check box and then click on this save. So you have done with the point number two or you can say task number two. Now what we do? We have to just me set the account recovery. For that what we do? First of all we have to create a user. So just me click on this hamburger and then click on this directory and then click on this users over here. Now just me wait. Now just me click on this add new user. Now just me type first name quick. and for the last name lab like this way and then click on this add new user over here now just me copy this password just me copy like that and save this password to your notepad or anything else like this way like this okay now what we do just me come back to the lab instructions just me scroll down and from this just me open this link in incognito window like this way and as you can see we are logged in with the workship okay so now just me click on this add account like this way and now for this email id what we do just me come back over here click on this done now just me refresh the page now click on this name quick lab and from here just me copy this email id just me copy like this come back over here and just me paste over here and hit enter now for the password come back to the notepad and just me copy the password which you just copied copy like this come back over here just me wait now just me paste hit enter click on this i understand and now for the create password just me come back to the lab instructions and from here just me copy this password copy like this come back over here paste now again just me paste and then click on this save with password and it's done from here you can just me cross verify that you are logged in with the quick lab now what you do just me click on the security over here scroll down now here you can see recovery email now here please pay attention just me click over here Now here you have to just simply use your personal email ID. So I'm going to use that, like this way. Just simply copy your email ID, copy like this. Come back over here and just simply paste over here, like this way. Now just simply click on this next. Now here you will get a verification code. So just simply wait for that. And then click on this verify over here. and is done now if we just simply come back to the lab instructions and if we just simply scroll down over here and click on this check my progress you will get a score without any issue just simply wait and watch as you can see we got a score now for the task number 3 we don't have to perform as you can see it's optional now just simply click on the task number 4 just simply scroll down and from here just simply copy the settings over here just simply copy like this come back to your admin console and now here just simply search for that like this way Now here you can see the third option apps google cloud workspace this one just me click on this settings over here now just me choose the allow user to install and run the allow list just me click choose that and then click on this save is done now here you can see app list over here just me click over here and then choose the allow list app like this way and now here for the name just me type meet like this way wait for a second and now from here you can just simply choose any one so i'm going to choose like meet and then click on this select now make sure that it must be allow user to install this app and then click on this continue it must be for everyone and then click on this finish now just simply wait for the this task get complete and it's done now if you just simply scroll down and click on this check my progress you will get a score without any issue and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please do let me in the comment section thanks for watching and have a good day guys